Hey people, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl Mills and I'm back with another video. We're getting into Brazil for the very first time. I'm going to tell you things which you need to know. So the first one is the currency. So you need to know the currency. In Brazil, we use their reals. One dollar equivalent to 5.5. One euro is equivalent to six Yes. Number two, the capital city of Brazil is not Sao Paulo. The capital city of Brazil is not Rio de Janeiro. It is Brasilia. The next thing you also need to know is Brazil is the fifth largest country in the world. The next thing you need to know about Brazil is the language. Because many people feel like many of their countries in South America actually speak Spanish, but Brazil is the only country that actually speaks Portuguese. It is always good for you to know the time to visit. You don't want to visit Brazil during the cold period, all right? There is winter in Brazil, so you need to do your research and know the times that you visit. In Brazil, when you use the toilet, you don't have to put the tissue paper into the toilet. The toilet is made such that it has like small holes. If you use the tissue paper, it is going to get clogged in the toilet. So make sure you want to put your tissue after use into trash cans that are always put by the side of the toilet. Another thing you need to know is Brazil is not only Sao Paulo and Rio. Brazil is not only two states. Brazil has 26 states in total. You have many different cities. Most people feel like Brazil is just Sao Paulo and Rio. No, you have 26 different states, okay? Major app that is used for most things in Brazil is WhatsApp. So you want to get a WhatsApp downloaded on your phone because almost everything, selling, buying, everything, transactions, they always have like the WhatsApp. Connect to the WhatsApp, anything, customer service, for everything is connected to WhatsApp. That's the most popular uh, social media app that is being used in Brazil. Now the next thing here deals with safety. If you're in Brazil, like in bigger cities or larger cities like Sao Paulo or Rio, you don't want to dress very expensive. Don't wear like flashy stuff on your body, like jewelry, flashy jewelry, flashy stuff because you're going to be robbed. You want to dress simple and you know, when you're going out to the beach and all those places, you just want to dress simple. Don't dress too sophisticated. You know what I mean? The next one, in some cities, you, you can drink tap water, but sometimes the water is not that good. So many people go for bottled water. Bottled water is not that expensive, but you don't want to be living your free, maybe three days, two days, you have to get like 10 liters of water. So most of the times people go in for filters. You can get it from supermarkets and you're good to go, okay? This is also a safety tip. Be careful how you move around in night. You know, there the places here, the call for availers. You don't want to move alone. You want to move as a group and also you don't move alone in dark places in the night, okay? This is also a safety tip and it's very important for you to know that. So in Brazil, you can pay everything using your debit or credit card. If you go to the beach, you can pay for coconut water, with a credit card you can buy anything if you go to the market area if you go to their uh, shopping center if you go anywhere uber everything you want to buy you want to just buy like banana you want to buy fruits you want to buy anything you can use your debit card okay so they have all the payment machine that you can use to, for payment so that is also a safety tip because you don't want to move around with cash you, can, you might get robbed before getting to Brazil, these are the most important things you need to know. If you find this video interesting, make sure you like it, you give it a thumbs up, you share, and make sure you hit the notification bell so that you get updated every time I put up a video. In that same light, ciao!